everyone it's now mikanaika from gospel it's a beautiful sunday happy sunday to you all from my home to yours i am so glad a sunday is dawned and god is so faithful today is a day that we can worship him praise him honor him and magnify him and you know what we are not the only beings worshiping our god today the angels are singing angels are worshiping angels are ministering for god's glory my brother and sister god has created us you and i and god had a great plan for you and i and even the angels are ministering to you and me today today i want to talk to you a little bit about angels and what they do and how we benefit having angels around us and how god's plan is amazing and yesterday uh, my children we love to do a painting every evening saturday afternoon evening and uh, we were planning what to paint and we have already done christmas trees we have already done the 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 baby, uh, baby jesus and joseph and mary that nativity scene so we were wondering what are we going to paint today and then i remember the angel so we drew a beautiful angel and we colored in paints with the trumpet blowing and that reminds me to talk about angels today and how privileged you and I that we have angels I don't see them but they are around me you don't see them but they are around you they are these beautiful beings that God has created and today I want to talk to you a little, little bit about what they do they guide us they protect us they proclaim the message from God and they minister with us and uh, the assurance of God's divine presence over our life they comfort us they encourage us they enlighten us in the old testament we've heard many times ministering angels will come and uh, help the prophets those days help the god's people those days and comfort them encourage them and, uh, and nourish uh, nourish them so today we don't see the angels around but they are here with us to protect us to guide us to proclaim god's goodness in over our life Today I want to talk to you about the, about uh, the angels coming to minister uh, in Luke chapter 2 verse 8 and it says there were shepherds living out in the fields nearby keeping watch over their flocks at night. The shepherds as usual in Jerusalem or nearby cities they were all watching their sheep in the night time and we can see an angel of the Lord appear to them and the glory of the Lord shone around them. Whenever the angel come, the glory of the Lord shone around them. They live in heaven, heavenly beings. So the glory of God is on them. They are in the midst of God all the time. And the glory of the Lord shone around them. And they were terrified. But the angel said to them, Do not be afraid. I bring you good news that will cause great joy for all the people. Today in the town of David, a Savior has been born to you. He is Messiah, the Lord. This will be a sign to you. You will find a baby wrapped in clothes and lying in a manger. The angels, when they saw these celestial beings, the shepherds of what afraid. And they said, do not be afraid. We are bringing good news to you. And that good news is that in the town of David, today is born the Savior, the Messiah, the Lord Jesus and he's wrapped in a manger go and visit them <clears throat> we can see suddenly in luke chapter 2 it says suddenly a great company of the heavenly host appeared with the angel praising god and saying glory to god in the highest heaven and on earth peace to those who his favor rest when the angels had left them and gone into heaven the shepherds said to one another let's go to bethlehem and see this thing that had happened which the Lord has told us about. When the Lord wants to speak to us, He sends angels. And that was those days. Nowadays, the Holy Spirit, His own presence lives inside of me and you today. Holy Spirit will convey the message to us, minister to us, encourage us. And my brother and sister, we still have angels around us. 
you and I would not see them, but they are around us protecting us. I know many, many times if I was in an accident, God protected them. Many times he avoided me getting into an accident. Many times he has protected my children from falling, from dangers, from all things, evil things that are around us. God's protection is always around and that is through his angels he sent us protection so today my brother and sister do you need an angel to see and believe that there are angels around you or do you trust in the Word of God which says there are angels <clears throat> watching over you and they are bringing you good news today if you have never accepted Jesus into your heart that is the proclamation the angels brought to the shepherds who never knew Jesus and today I am bringing that message to you and say glory to God in the highest because today if you believe in the Lord Jesus Christ you and your family will be saved you and your family will enter heaven and in heaven you will see angels you will see ministering angels you will feel the presence of God today now you will not see your angel but some people have seen but I've never seen an angel but I believe the Word of God which says there are angels around me protecting me there's there's an angel in charge of my life my brother and sister aren't we so blessed so do you want to belong to that family where the Father God commands the angels to cover you lest you fall and strike your foot on the ground? That is how faithful He watches over you while you sleep. He watches over your family, your children, your generation to come. That is the heritage of those who believe in Christ Jesus. Do you believe in the Lord Jesus today? Accept Him into your heart. Worship Him. Honor Him today. Let's pray. Father God, we come to you with humble hearts saying, Lord, what am I that you would be mindful of me, that you would send angels in charge of me, that you would prepare the way for me. God, you are good. You're amazing. You're faithful. Lord, if no one will accept you, I don't know, Lord, because you've done everything possible for mankind we only have to accept this free gift so lord i come to you humbly and say thank you thank you that you came to my life many many years ago and i accepted you as my lord and my savior and i will preach i will speak about you till the day i die lord for that i give you glory thank you for the ministering angels around us thank you for the holy spirit your own presence living inside of us in jesus name we pray one day the trumpet will sound and Jesus will call your name. Will you hear that trumpet sound? I don't know who will blow the trumpet. Maybe the angels will blow the trumpet. My brother and sister, let me show you. Let me show you uh, of the angel that we drew yesterday. This is the angel on top of a Christmas tree blowing the trumpet and but they are glorious beings that God has created. Have yourself a wonderful day, my brother and sister. May you worship God in spirit and truth. And may you remember there are ministering angels around you. As you minister and worship God and glorify Him, the angels are singing. The angels are saying, Holy, 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 Holy Lord. Let us worship Him today. Have yourself a wonderful day. God bless you. I'm going inside and getting ready to go to church. God bless you. Have, have a wonderful Sunday. Bye. Share this message. Subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed. And may God bless you. Bye.